Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, The MK Lady. Well, it's Saturday and I'm just getting ready to go to Saskatoon. We're going to go to the Midtown Mall and to the Lawson Heights Mall. And we're going to meet my son and his girlfriend for uh, maybe a late lunch, early supper type of thing. So I do have an outfit that I put together and it is basically almost all Michael Kors. But... I will start with my earrings. They're really cute Michael Kor earrings. They're little hearts with little studs on the side and they're so cute. I got them at the Bay probably, I would say, a couple years ago and they've held up. They're very light. They're nice and comfortable. They don't hurt my ears so I really do like them. And I also put on my Michael Kors gold watch and so speaking of gold I do have my Michael Kors spring jacket as you can see right there it's really really cute I do like it a lot this shirt isn't Michael Kors though this shirt is Calvin Klein so there's one other label in there I wanted to show you as well I do I'm gonna stand back a bit I do have these Michael Kors leather boots and I've had them probably about two years and like I don't wear them out when it's raining and when it's snowing they're just summer you know fall spring kind of boots and they're really really comfortable and they've held they've held they've stood the test of time and so the purse of the day that I'm gonna take with me on my travels is the Michael Kors Whitney shoulder chain bag. As you can see, it's the black and the gold. So keeping with my theme, black and gold and the gold Michael Kors, I'll just show you what I have inside because I did downsize it. So I did change out my wallet because I wanted to match a little bit more. Oops, my receipt. So here's what I have inside. So it is my regular Safiano leather Michael Kors wallet. And I did change out my makeup bag because that Sephora bag was just a little bit too big and I wanted to carry some other things. So there's hand sanitizer, there's lipstick and lip balm, floss and Tylenol or medication, a hair comb, and a nail file, all in that. And I am carrying this, this Laura Mercer Mercier foundation. I am going to return it. I mean, I really do like it, but it's the wrong color and it makes my skin look really, really orange. So I really do like that. This one is the Flawless Fusion. And like I said in another video, I had a sample of this and I really, really liked it. And so I picked up the full size bottle, but I didn't get the right color. So I'm gonna return that. So I'll give you guys a good look at what all is inside. So there is a back zip pocket, as you can see right there. And then a small front slip compartment. And one of my other viewers had said that you know, in the middle zip compartment right here, she does put her phone. So I think that's where I'm gonna store my phone. Cause remember I said before, and I'll just grab it. So if I were to take regular iPhone and stick it on the front of the bag where the slip pocket is, it just slightly sticks out. And so I probably will just slide my phone on the inside and so that'll work out perfectly so I'll just fill it back up with my stuff because I'll show you what it looks like as in terms of mod shots and I was asked by one of my subscribers to do more mod shots and I've been rushing through these videos so I'm actually gonna do some mod shots today so 
as you can see, I put everything back, even the Laura Mercier. I should put my receipt before I forget it. Because I am going to do an exchange and get my right color. So, you can wear it with the, the long chains just like this and wear it. I'm five, five and a half in terms of reference and wear it as a shoulder bag and medium build and you can wear it as a long shoulder bag just like that and one of my subscribers was asking can it be crossbody so I'll just go ahead and show you it sits a little high like my hip area and it can be crossbody I mean it doesn't look too too bad crossbody this sticks out a little bit I wonder if I can stick it well I, no I could stick it back down so it doesn't look too bad as a crossbody so if you're needing to be hands-free oh yeah I forgot to tell you this jacket has a hood on it and it's water resistant as well so that is the purse of the day and that's the one that I'm gonna take on my travels and hopefully it all works out hopefully I find something at the Michael Kors store now I wanted to tell you something else I was gonna return this I was little debating on it what I wanted to do with it but it is just so beautiful. I'm gonna keep it. I have some other orders uh, in my cart right now and I just, just seeing this, it's so pretty. And so this is the exact same bag, but in the ox blood color. And it's just so pretty. And I do like the size. The size is not very big. As you can see, I can only fit my makeup bag and <clears throat> my wallet and just another small item so if you're looking for a big bag this is probably too small for you but it does have a lot of structure and it does go in so the inside of the bag is a little bit smaller and that's what I do find with these Whitney's is that they they go in in the inside and I'm just gonna grab the medium Whitney here as you can see so it is smaller and I'll put them compared together. This one is just a little bit taller, but on the inside, because they do go in, <clears throat> and even on the large Whitney, it does go in, and it does, <clears throat> sorry, I got a frog in my throat right now. So it is smaller on the inside. So I'll get back to this Michael Kors that I'm going to be taking. So this is the purse of the day and thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, The MK Lady. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so every time I upload a video, you will get notified and have a great weekend. Bye!